Hello subscribers, today is Tuesday, June 27th, and thank you so much for joining me on another day of trading. And I lost today, I hate to report that, but I lost today. The good news, I didn't lose a whole lot of money. I lost something like 4%, 4.6%, somewhere around there. That's the great news. I just wanted to give you a quick moment because today's uh, video is uh, a little bit on the long side. And you, a little bit of motivation for, for you guys uh, at home. You gotta love what you're doing. Uh, because if you don't love what you're doing uh, when you start losing in the stock market, especially in the stock market, but this again holds true to, to anything in life. If you don't love what you're doing, um, you're not going to do great work. And you got to find your passion. Um, I love trading. I love the stock market. Absolutely do. And I love doing something that not a lot of people um, relatively speaking, know how to do or trade. I'm trading options and I only trade options on SPY, SPY, the ETF for the S&P 500. And I'm so sorry I didn't put out a video yesterday. I did not trade. I did have a, a small window, small opportunity to trade, uh, but I was so busy. I was not focused on my computer early in the morning, right at the market open. And I had about an hour of leeway before I had to go to my part-time day job. I did have to go work again. Uh, for a full day yesterday. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button, like and share my videos. I would absolutely appreciate it. And comment below what you traded today, what you made money on, what you lost money on. We can all help each other out um, if need be or if you need um, any help. If you have any questions, I would greatly appreciate um, uh, just any feedback at all. That would be great. Thank you so much for watching. June 27th, and I'm looking for a uh, setup here. It's looking uh, really good here for a setup. I'm looking at the 243 puts that expire tomorrow. We have some uh, good support here, 242.70. We need to break that in order for it to uh, go lower. I haven't bought anything yet. I'm still looking at the 243 puts. Still nothing. Um, it's looking like strong uh, support around these price levels. So I went ahead and bought in. Bought it in the 243 puts at 69 cents. It's kind of hanging in there. It's okay. There it goes. We're going. We're gaining some speed here. Got in a little on the high side, but that's okay. I'm still in it. There it goes. Going lower. Mm. Not getting the push that I want here. Still in it here. <clears throat> I'm not liking this action, so I went ahead and got out. Took a very small loss. Uh, no big deal. I just didn't like how uh, it didn't quite have that push that I was hoping for. Uh, the five minutes um, looks like it's bottoming out right here, uh, but it's all right. Live to see another day. Didn't lose much at all. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah, yeah I'm glad I got out of it. Um, 
just no momentum, no true momentum here. Um, you can see as soon as I, I got in on this candlestick, it reversed on me and went back down. Um, I, I was up maybe a cent or two, maybe three cents, not enough. Um, it's okay. No, uh, no biggie. Ultimately, I'm glad I got out where I did. I got out at this candle here. You can see it's trading uh, higher. I got in at 69, sold at 66, small loss. Uh, they're now trading at 59 cents. Yep, it is trading higher. Those uh, puts are trading a lot lower now. Um, ultimately, I'm, I made the right decision getting out when I did. Um, it feels good. It feels good. That's, that's a uh, win in my book to recognize when the setup is not um, happening uh, and, uh, and getting out. Hello again, everybody. I came back to my computer and I noticed something incredible and uh, I just wanted to share it with you. I, even though I did not trade it, I was not on my computer at the time, but I came back and I saw something just truly amazing that I just had to share with you in today's video. It made for an amazing setup right here, right at this candle at the one minute, the one minute, five minute and 15 minute were just extremely strong. It was quite amazing. Um, and, and I did not trade it. I wish I did, but I was not at my computer and I want to show you um, what happened with the puts today that I traded and sold at a loss. And I'm sure you already uh, saw that preview there. I bought here at this candle. You can see over here my cursor right here. I bought at 69 cents right at the top of that candle. Went down, went back up. Didn't have the strength that I needed and I sold at 66. Probably around this candle. It was at this candle actually right there. And they, they continued going down lower. They got to as low as 27 cents. And look what happened when the markets moved right here. This was the perfect setup. Um, and I'll show you exactly what happened here. So it got back up to where I bought and, and sold. I got a high of 72 cents, uh, same high that I had uh, when I first got in. And look what happened here. They got up to a high of 138. That is huge. That is phenomenal. Right here, you can see my cursors. So whenever I have, uh, uh, when I have my, my cursor set on one uh, chart, it'll show up on the other chart. And right here, right at this candle, um, the high was 89 cents. Even if you got in right at the high, look at that jump to 133 amazing oh, excuse me 132 and then they came back down and then went back up because uh, of the underlying stock uh, spy and anyways i just wanted to show you guys the power of options i i buy and sold and i lost a little bit of money but in the grand scheme of things it's not a big deal i uh, i will make that up i promise you and uh, I just wanted to take uh, the time to, to show you this and um, give you a little bit of math for all you guys that uh, like to play penny stocks. This is just like penny stocks, guys. Uh, I'm trading for pennies, uh, literally, uh, right? I, I bought at 69, sold at 66 cents. And, and I just want to show you here, even, even if you bought right here at the high 89 cents and it got up to a high of 132. 43 cents. That's 48 percent, guys. 48 percent from right here. That's the extreme high right there that you would have been getting in. And I mean, you could, you heck, you could have sold right here. You could have kept going, and you could have sold at a dollar nine. That was a huge. That's a huge move right there. That's 20 cents right there, guys. And came back down to 97 cents, and still you could have sold at, at a good profit. And then you could have ridden this huge way back up to 132. Guys, I am in love 
with my strategy. I'm in love with my setup. I am absolutely um, blown away um, by the returns that, that it's possible. And I originally thought that it was something that uh, Janet Yellen uh, possibly said, but it turns out that the Senate um, is going to delay the health care vote until after July 4th. And that's what sparked this uh, this downward momentum. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'm going to work harder to uh, find these setups. Uh, find these setups that just absolutely blow up. Thank you so much for everybody that has subscribed. I absolutely appreciate it. It shows me a lot of support and the confidence that I need to keep giving you these videos. And I absolutely appreciate it, guys. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if this is your first time watching my video. And uh, share and like my videos. Comment below what you traded, what you made money on, what you lost money on today. Uh, we can all uh, help each other out and, and uh, make some money. Thank you so much for watching, everybody.